I listen to these Fox people on the news, elderly. Shut, just close your ears when you hear a negative, dour, elderly person. Let me tell you why. When you're older, you have two things that are detrimental. You are not as strong physically, and you have more possessions. So you view the world very defensively. Is that fair to say? Do you hear your grandparents always talking about how bad the world is, it's unsafe and all this? From their vantage point, it's true. They got a bunch of possessions and they're not strong. Now, we have two narratives of how to raise a child. Garrett, are you listening? We have two narratives of how to raise a child. One is the world's going to hell in a handbasket. Everything's dour, everything's bad, 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 bad. And the other one is, you know, this is kind of an interesting world. It works. The people stop at the red lights, they go on the green lights. It's, it kind of works. Los Angeles is much cleaner than it used to be. I mean, you look at the optimism. Do you think you're going to make a hell of a lot more money if you look at everything, how it works and works right, or how a dysfunctional the world is? What do elderly look at? How dysfunctional it is. You ever talked to an older person that said, yeah, I think it's kind of cool. They're kind of cool over there. I had a good time on planet Earth. Everything is screwed up. Is that right? You can't even get a nice comp, com, comment about society in any way, shape, or means. From, don't listen to them. The world is great. It's getting better. But you all at your age have two narratives. One is these dour people are correct. Why engage in the world? Because it's going to hell in a handbasket. Environment's going to wipe us out and all that. Crime and these commie bastards and these uh, all this. I don't know who else. But other, oh, the terrorists are going to wipe us out. Or this is a really cool planet and it's really interesting. You know, I bet I can make a bunch of money from what goes right. Now, do you think you're going to make a hell of a lot more money from what's going right or what's wrong in society? You're not going to make a dime from what's wrong and dysfunctional. You're going to make all the money from what's right in society. People aren't honorable and trustworthy. I've done it in my career. I found people always rose to the level of trust I gave them. People are innately good. Remember Hobbes and Rousseau, they had that little argument. People are innately good. They want to do a good job. Every government worker that goes to work doesn't go to work every day and say, oh, let me go and do a bad job so I can screw over society. Yet we call them bureaucrats. People really do think they do a good job and they contribute to society, every one of them.